No, 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 it's not. Oh, no, dude, I've been caught. I've actually been caught. There's a guy up there. No joke, there is a guy up there. Going and welcome back to another episode of Factions. Today's video, holy smokes, gets intense. Very, very intense. <laughs> I would say probably 90% of this video is me panicking. Probably. But before we get into that, make sure to grab some popcorn. It's a good episode, I think. And also, while the popcorn is popping, make sure you pop down to the like button. Give it a smash. It'd be great you. Greatly appreciate it. Sorry, I had to say the pop. <laughs> but honestly, guys, thank you very much for all the support on this show. And don't forget, guys, daily code is hidden inside these videos for one free mystical charm. Just make sure that you redeem the mystical charm on any other server except which. I still don't think mystical charms are out yet. But anyway, let's do this. So before we get into today's episode, we're going to open up one in China Charm. Now, I'm gonna get rid of these pots, I don't need them, and I don't want my inventory filling up. But since it's the start of the map, that means that in China Charms are pretty godly. Like, I need prop 4, I wouldn't even mind prop 3, I need cash, I need pretty much everything inside here. Everything is decent. All these spawners are really, really decent. Anyway, let's do this. The only probably thing I wouldn't need is maybe tools. That's the only thing I wouldn't need. And maybe, and maybe the axe. I wouldn't mind a sharpness five. But anyway, let's do this. Pop this open. Okay. <gasps> Dude, hello, holy nugget. I have not got you in forever. So it would be lovely if I did get you. Okay, it's rolling. We're going to roll the first one. The holy nugget is there. Dude, I want that. I don't know if anyone's got it. This, <gasps> no frick. Okay, never mind. That was way too hype. I honestly thought it was about to roll in it. We got a prop three set. Okay, we'll take that. Dude, no. I honestly thought it was about to roll in it. Okay, is there any holy nugget here? No, there's not. And I don't think you can get the holy nugget in the bones reward either. Okay. That is lovely, jubbly skeleton spawner. Yes, please. And let's roll this for hopefully some extra cash. And... Nothing on a bonus reward. I thought we were about to get 30,000 bonus. But no. But there we go. We got a set of prop 3. I'll take it. I actually don't mind it. We also get infused elixirs with it. But we also got the skeleton spawner. Now, we'll keep that most likely. But we could also sell it for a good bit of money. But we're doing good in the money department right now. But anyway, guys. Enjoy the raid. It's a goodie. Okay, so we're outside this base. And we're going to be attempting to use the 420, which I have not used in a very, very long time to get inside this base because it's only really one wall one water wall that we have to go through i just don't know if this is going to work or not i have no idea because like as you can see like this isn't the greatest cannon in the world it's very small and a little bit unreliable and also we're a pretty good distance away from the base so I don't know if there's enough power inside this. But the faction we're raiding is called Curse Clan. If we break into the bottom of the base, they have a ladder from the bottom to the tippy, tippy top. So we can raid the whole lot. Now, I did work that out. There's no spawners inside there. From what I know, not placed down anyway. But it looks more like a cactus farm. But it's just for a bit of fun to raid it. But I just don't know if this cannon's going to work. So I guess we're going to find out. I have the cannon filled. It's probably going to... Please, Cannon, don't backfire me. It's probably going to backfire me. Let me uh, disable the sand comp because we don't need it really working. Let's stick on this and let's give the shot. I hope that it has enough range. If it has enough range, I think we should be able to easily, easily do this if I don't mess this up. But it could go wrong. And they could also find me. If they're active, they might hear me cannoning away. Okay, this is actually working so far, but we're only going through stone. <laughs> I'd be I'd be worried if it wasn't working. Basically, the worry is, is that we need to make sure that the sand and the TNT can get over there at the exact same time and just split the wall. That's all we need to do. Okay, so I'm just keeping an eye through here. I can still I can still see it's going through now. I do, I do wish I had like Raven on to help me out because then he could like say it's working fine. And also, he probably wouldn't have built this cannon, let's be real. Are you serious? Of course, lava has to come down and obstruct my view. Now I can't see at all. I can't see a thing. I just gotta assume it's working. Okay, let me go see if that's working or even if we, we might have even got to the walls. I wouldn't even know. Okay, we have got to the walls. Okay, that is perfect. We're actually not that far away, actually. I thought we were further. It just felt like further. If I fireball you, do I get rid of you? Will you go? No, it's not gonna go. Oh, wait. 
Oh, it is. Oh, perfect. Go away. That's it. Perfect. Okay, right. So we've got through all the stone. Now we're actually on the last wall. That is last wall. All we need now is the cannon to hybrid correctly, which I don't know if it will because, as I said, this is a very, very old cannon and it's pretty unreliable. Okay, right. So let's grab some sand. Let's reconnect this. There we go because we need sand now. One shot should do it, I think. <laughs> okay, I can't remember if I need to turn this on or turn it off. I think you don't need it on. But then part of me is saying that you do need it on. Okay, right, we'll fire without it. If it goes wrong, we'll just wait for a fireball. We can get rid of it and we can restart. Okay, dokie, here goes. Come on, cannon. Break me into this beautiful base. <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh, no. <gasps> No freaking way! I thought that didn't work. That just fired more sand than I thought. Oh my god, no freaking way that worked. Oh my god. Cannon, thank you so much, dude. It actually broke us in. Let's go, dude. Okay, right. I'm actually so shook. I honestly expected about... Let's head home quickly before we get... Uh, before they come online or see me or whatever. I'm actually so shook. I literally thought I'd be messing around with the cannon for the next 30 minutes just to break that one wall. But it worked on the first shot. And we've got... Some dispensers, which should we take? E yeah, I guess. We got more obsidian. Okay, right. We should definitely be taking obsidian. We're going to need so much of that if we're building a massive base. Honestly, I'm s <laughs> I am so surprised. I When I saw all the sand like scatter across, I was like, there's no way this is going to work. But it did. Okay, we got trench and TNT. We don't actually... We probably should take that because... We actually do need it. We are trenching a massive base and it does cost a lot of money. Okay, let me go home, Cactus. Let me, I need the store. But there should be a ladder just around that corner going all the way to the top. Hello, my tip. But I actually love reset because, like, you use all different sorts of stuff. You raid all different types of bases. Like, we used a 420 instead of using, like, a 40 sack or a 240. I haven't used that cannon in ages. <laughs> Like a very long time. Okay, right. So there's an efficiency for pickaxe. We'll take that. That's actually decent loot down at the bottom of the base. But I'm not gonna lie. These guys, Curse Clan, made a very, very bad mistake. You should never have a ladder going all the way to the top of your base. Unless they blocked it off. I see obsidian there, but I think that might be the roof. Or maybe they did block it off. Uh-oh. They actually, maybe, it either could be the roof. Or they blocked it off, so they may have actually heard me canning. Uh-oh. And I don't have a chicken mask on me, which I should probably get right now. I'm gonna. I know it's risky grabbing my chicken mask, because I, I could get dropped very easily, but at least I can't die from fall damage. I'm actually gonna crouch going up here, just in case they are up there. Oh my god, it's taken about a half an hour to climb up this freaking thing. You know what? I think that might just be the roof. I think we're good. No, 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 it's not. Oh, no, dude, I've been caught. I've actually been caught. There's a guy up there. No joke, there is a guy up there. Oh, no, dude. No, I should have climbed straight up to the base. I didn't know that they would hear that. But obviously they did. Unless he doesn't. No, that's definitely blocked off. That's definitely blocked off. Hang on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've, <laughs> they've definitely spotted me. No, dude. Maybe they might come down and fight. I wouldn't mind if they did because I do have a chicken mask on me. So I'll be pretty cool with that. Okay, right, hang on. Let's grab some segs in case things get really messy. We might be able to seg our way up, maybe. Dude, you cheeky little nugget, you spotted me. Okay, um, he obviously knows I'm here, so there's no point playing a little game. I could try something really cheeky. I could go shop. Hope that, go get an invisibility pot. Hope, maybe he might think that I'm gone. He might open up the base to check if I'm still down there. Oh, there, there he is. That's him right there. That's him right there. I can't drink the invisible heart right now because he's going to know. But then he might think I'm gone. But I'm not actually gone. Okay, look. He's right there. He, has obs he even has obsidian in his hand. All I'm going to say is he's very lucky he's active. Otherwise, that whole base could have been raided. Okay, right. I'm just going to sit here right now. I'm just going to stay invisible. So that hopefully he might cheekily open up the base. And I might be able to get maybe a pearl off or something like that. There's no... If I seg, I'm just going to go down and down and down. There's no way I can go up. If he put, like, a block here, it could have been possible. At least it was an absolute waste of time. Like, it'd be a different story if I built a massive cannon to get inside there, but we built the tiniest cannon. Okay, we're gonna just chuck a seg over here. I don't know why. I guess it's a safety plan if something goes wrong. Come on, seg. Huh. Wait a second. Wait a second. I have an idea. I think I might know how we can get inside here. Segs, I need you to swim up, and then I need to knock them out here to see if I could... Would that work? I don't know. That could possibly work. Hang on, this could possibly work. Hey, Segs. If I just punch you over... Oh, this is difficult, but I think it could work. No way. That work? That's getting closer. If I keep doing that, that will work eventually. 
We can get in here, I think. I don't know. I, I just believe we can. Dude, we're one block away. Oh my god, we're actually going up the base. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. We've gotten to this section. Has he blocked up the whole entire thing? Oh, the cheeky nugget has. Okay, right. Well, we'll have to do these mind out all the hoppers and everything as well. Oh, hello, cactus. Hello. Dude, we've got this. We can I can just do the same thing again. Okay, that was smart. We've got cactus cell anyway. Oh, okay, boom. There we go. Right, but we need more segs. Kit over. No, no. Sorry, I'm not an overlord anymore. I'm an anarchist. Kit anarchist. Give me those segs. I don't care about any of the rest of the loot. Maybe the TNT, but oh well. I don't care. Right, we have to do the same thing again. Dude, we're so freaking close to getting in. All I need is segs. Come on, my tip. Come with segs, dude. <laughs> we can get in. It's probably all raided, but at least we know we could get in. Hey, buddy. Can I have segs? I need segs. <laughs> Thank you. It's how many? It's five. Okay. Whew. It's really tough to do. Oh, dude, we're so close. Okay, he's giving me five more. It's like an allowance. <laughs> okay, right. Let's try this again. It's really tough to do because you got to get the timing just right. Okay, this is the last five. He doesn't have any more. I'm sure people will have... Some will have more. Oh, come on. One more block. That's all we need. Um... Okay, I'm asking my tip to buy my pot for 100k and I can buy 10 more segs. So we need one more and we can get up there. Dude, this is so tense. I didn't know this was natural tactic. I didn't know you could do it like this. It's probably not worth it, but it's just fun. Oh, he just bought the segs. Okay, he just bought the segs. That's okay. No, get up here, dude. <laughs> we need to hurry before they attack us. <laughs> I say they're moving everything out of this base. And when we get up here, it's just going to be an empty box. All right, thank you, dude. <laughs> I hope I can do it with these 13 segs. One more block is all we have to go up. One more. Oh, we did it. We actually did it. Holy smokes. Let's go. I'm up. I'm up. I'm up. I don't know if everything's been moved out. Dude, my God, it hasn't been moved. Is that trenching TNT? No? Oh, troll. Oh, no, it's not. Dude, let's go. Let's freaking go. Oh, my God. We actually managed to climb up the whole entire base. I did not know that that was a tactic. Home. Cactus. Oh my god. G G. Oh, oh my lordy. I cannot believe we just got into that. G freaking G. I thought the raid was over. I'm sure a lot of you guys thought the raid was over. But we got to tippy top. And there's TNT here. And that's a very important thing at the moment. And the people who own this base is nowhere to be found. I'm assuming they blocked off the base and think that it's safe. I'm just gonna guess that. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm being attacked. Oh no, I'm being attacked, dude. <laughs> F enemy pro or cursed clan. There we go. There we go. No, I can't change relations. What? I'm not promoting my own faction. Dude, more TNT. I'm nabbing it. I'm nabbing it. I'm nabbing it. No, you're not blocking me in. I'm taking your stuff, dude. I'm taking... Oh, ooh, very nice. Okay, right. If he's going to block up the stuff, I'm going to blow up the stuff. There we go. There we go. Come on. Someone enemy him. Someone enemy him. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Okay, right. We can't attack back. For some reason, I'm not even promoting my... Oh, there we go. There we go. We can fight back. Let's go, dude. That's it. We can fight back. Okay, you run and hide. You run and hide. Yeah, that's it. Go into the corner. Okay, no, let's kill him. Let's kill him. Let's kill him. Let's, kill him. let's get his head. He's going to try to block us in. That's fine. Keep him in the corner. Hey, keep him in the corner. Keep some pressure up on him. Get some crits on him. Because if we weaken him, the better. Okay, actually, if he wants to block himself in, he can do that as well. Oh, but my tip is going ham with it. My tip is going ham with it. My tip's just going in. Oh my god, this is such a tense raid. Holy smokes. Okay, my tip might get trapped here. I've got you, my tip. I've got you, my tip. I've got you. I've got you. I've got you. I've got you. I've got you, my tip. Get out of there, buddy. I've got you, buddy. Oh, I killed him, my tip. You're safe. You're safe, buddy. Come here. Seg, seg, seg. Okay, right. Oh my god, look at the amount of armor this guy had. TPS. Okay, right. Dude, look at the amount of armor here on the floor. There he is. He's right. He's grabbing more armor. No, you don't. No, you don't, you cheeky little nugget. Come here. No, you're not grabbing more stuff. You're dying. You're dying. <laughs> Come here, buddy. Keep on the pressure. Keep on the pressure. He wants to defend his home. He's probably like, how the hell did you get up? Okay, well, my tip, my tip, you go after him. Oh, dude, prop four. Holy smokes, I'll take that. Oh, my God. Oh, loads of prop four. Let's -a go, dude. Dude, this is the most tensest raid ever. Home cactus. Okay, my tip is after him. I can't raid this. TP here, underscore Mikey. Let him come raid because there's so much to pick up. Dude, there's his head. Let me see if his head's worth anything. <gasps> no way. Is that actually the real price? $279,000? Oh, yes, please. I will take that. No problemo. Holy smokes. Okay, right. So this might seem like the tenses raid, and that's because it was. Because for some reason, I think I left the faction do some testing with I Steal Your Head, and then obviously I forgot to get promoted again. 
So that's why I couldn't enemy in my own faction. So I was like spamming the chat, someone enemy, someone enemy. <laughs> Dude, I just got $283,000. Holy smokes. I think we might have just got up into that base in the nick of time before he started moving everything out. Or he thought that we couldn't get up there and was like, I'll just like protect it. You know what I mean? Okay, right. Let me grab this prop four on the floor because prop four and everything like that is super good right now. You need it because you drop a lot. You die a lot. I'm surprised he didn't die right now, to be honest. <laughs> I don't think he had a strength pot on because he wasn't doing mad damage to me. Okay, right. That's more obsidian than stuff. So my tip is, I think, just going after him, which is good. I also had a chicken mask on me. Oh my god, that could have been so bad if I died. But my tip is just distract him. So he's doing like the god's work right now and just keeping him at bay. But he tried to block up these chests here and I just wanted to blow him up because I didn't want to actually lose access to the chest. But we could have just segged around him. Oh dude, obsidian. No way. Nearly a dub. Trenching TNT. I should probably take that actually as well. Okay, I'm also going to take these tools. I'm going to take the decent tools. I'm not going to take the shovels. No one uses shovels. Barely anyway. And I'm going to... Yeah, yeah, I'm going to leave those. Sharpness trees, I'll take that. Spare pots. Oh, obsidian. I'm taking that. Need you. This was actually richer than I thought. The only thing that could basically top this off right now would be if there was actually spawners inside here. That would be amazing. Holy smokes, that was so tense. I literally thought I was going to die. I thought I was a dead man. No joke. Now, there are some chests here. I'm just trying to watch my back because I, I don't want to get jumped by a ton of people. I'm actually just... I might actually go seg a hole here in the corner. I did not know you could do that. I didn't know you could, like, make your way up with segs. I just kind of thought it in my head. I was like, if I just keep knocking them up, can I do that? And it actually worked. It cost a lot of money. I'm not going to lie. It probably cost us a hundred grand to get up to the top of the base. It would have cost me about two... Hello, buddy. Okay, I'm not really geared, but I'm going to use your pots that you have. Okay, he's running, is he? Oh, he's running. No, he's blocking it in. Hello, buddy. Okay, he's got obsidian. I'm probably going to die today, but look, it's been a great day. It's worked out well. He's he's trying to see if his stuff's been taken. No, he's grabbing pots. That's what he's doing. Hey, buddy. Come here. No, don't you dare block yourself in. Don't you dare. I need to be careful. I'm going to get myself trapped. I'm 100% going to get myself trapped. Okay, I'm going to seg a hole here because then he wants to block that up. That'll be a little distraction for him. There we go. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, he's fell down. Oh, hello, buddy. Okay, everything's being raided up there, so it doesn't matter if he goes back up there and blocks it up. We are good. Very, very good. Oh, he's blocking himself in. He's trying to get up. Oh, dude, knock him down the hole. There he goes. No, dude, I thought he was going to die. Oh, he's blocking himself in. Okay, right. I think he might have got away. Oh, dude, I wish I had my punched four bow out. Go, 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 go. I should probably leave the faction so I can hit my own team members so I can boost them up quick. Oh my god, I'm a tip with that knockback too. Oh, dude, he's about to drain me. <laughs> no, don't drain me. I think he's running. I think he knows that his base has been raided, so there's nothing worth saving anyway. Okay, so the pro gaming guy said, GG, good fight. So he's a good sport, which is good. I was expecting maybe an angry message. Sometimes you get that, but... <laughs> he said, hope you enjoy. Oh my god, what a good sport. Like, you know, you don't get like a lot of people who are like, oh, I hope you enjoyed the raid. Do you know what I mean? That's... What a nice guy. What a nice guy, honestly. Okay, well, that raid is over. Oh, my God, that was interesting. You know, it's so funny how, you know, a simple raid can turn so incredibly tense like that. And I'm not going to lie. I think we got in the perfect timing. Okay, I need to... I owe my tip 100000 back because he did spend segs on me. So I'm going to be honorable and give that money back to him. Okay, so my tip doesn't want the money back. He said he wanted to buy it for me, so... Thank you very much, Matip, and thank you very much for programming, for being a nice sport, and everyone who helped raid. Oh my god, that was just... That'll be a memorable raid, I'll tell you that. <laughs> that was a fairly rich raid, though, for the size of it, so I'm actually very impressed. I just think what must have happened, there's no way, there is no way that he heard me canning, unless he was down at the bottom of the base and then instantly went up to the top and blocked it off. Other than that, he must he must just got really lucky and spotted at the right time, but then just really unlucky that I managed to seg my way up. I didn't think that was possible. That was just a fluke. But anyway, guys, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed me panicking. <laughs> and I will see you guys in the next episode of Factions.